Leman Akademi yurt dışı eğitim aslında hem Türk pazarında hem de Çin pazarında çok aktif bir şekilde devam ediyor. Bakalım Çinli öğrencilerin durumları neymiş? Haydi. Haydi Leman. Oh my god. <gülüyor> <gülüyor> I love my Turkish students. They are quite hardworking inşallah. Not like Chinese, okay? <gülüyor> <gülüyor> Selamlar. Biliyorsunuz Lemon Akademi yurt dışı eğitim aslında hem Türk pazarında hem de Çin pazarında çok aktif bir şekilde devam ediyor. Ben de bugün aslında Michelle ile birlikteyim ve birazcık evet sizinle birlikte sürekli Türkçe konuşuyoruz, Türkçe videolar çekiyoruz, Türk öğrencilerinin durumlarını konuşuyoruz ama bakalım Çinli öğrencilerin durumları neymiş? Bir de Mişel'in gözünden dinleyelim istiyor. Bizim Çinli öğrencilerimiz ne yapıyorlar? Haydi. Hi, Jeremy. Hi, Today I would like to ask you, like the our Chinese students, yeah. how they adapt in uh, UK and uh, what is their most concern for the UK universities or something? Actually, Chinese students, uh, they don't uh, speak uh, English. So they are hard to uh, pass the. <laughs> oh my god! Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I have things. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, they don't. Uh, usually, they are oral, uh, oral speaking of that good, and they are uh, speak Chinese um, when they are with the kids. So, uh, so one bit barrier is the language so they have to speak English with the locals and increase their English level and then the food habit is different like Chinese food and how can I say so yeah like I think Chinese food are too spicy right no, or like like, oh. like, like, like stop for them. me it's too spicy okay <laughs> <laughs> so the difference between the uh, northern part of China is and the southern part you know, in China is different so northern part people they like the spice very spicy food but northern people they don't uh, yeah, but in the UK, they eat the Western style of food and Chinese food prefer more, how can I say, light? Yeah, light. yeah. yeah. Light. Not, that, not too much. Alright, but for the Chinese student coming to here, there's many opportunity. I see many Asian foods over there. Like Chinese markets, also Chinese student and the Asian food, Asian stores. Yeah. They, so uh, in London, uh, there are lots of the re uh, Chinese restaurants there because a lot of the Chinese students come to Academy UK. So, and also, as I know, uh, Chinese people is a very big population in London. So that's why. I think so. How many students uh, we have in London? I have to calculate, <laughs> but I think it's a lot. Yeah. I, I think so. Also, Chinese students prefer to come in language school, but most of them choosing the universities. Also, master programs, right? Yeah, they uh, if they are not good at speaking English, they will uh, join some pre uh, professional course like me. <laughs> I used to go to science and I study for eleven weeks professional course. Yeah, okay. yeah. I think it's good for prepare them to educational system, right? Yeah. What is the biggest like the difference between Chinese education system and the UK education system? In I think Chinese. Chinese student in China, they prefer to follow their teachers. Like they will, uh, they got a lot of the uh, homework, and they have to finish it before they go to school. And then they got a lot of the exam. They are feel very stressful and stressed. But in the but in the UK, British teachers more easy going and. Most of Chinese students or British students, they need to uh, learn by themselves. I think they are quite similar with the, like the Chinese and Turkish students. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How about Turkish people? <laughs> Turkish students. <laughs> I love my Turkish students. <laughs> <laughs>
They are quite hardworking, Michelle. Not, not like Chinese, okay? <laughs> the most uh, useful things I learned in the UK is they will increase our critical thinking and, and, and also the English speaking level. Yeah, increase that part. That, that part that so, I also want to ask you, like the Chinese student, when they're looking for a university, what is their focus? Most of them, to be honest, is ranking. <laughs> yeah, they will uh, pay attention about the QS top 100 uh, university. Um, how about you, the Turkish students? Turkish students generally focus on the price. <laughs> We are looking for the price, oh. but then the ranking is really important for them. Yeah, uh, but I think ranking is just uh, one of the conditions. It's not all, because they come, uh, how can I say, uh, they are depends on the different kind of the reason. Like, if, <laughs> sorry. So, uh, the ranking is, how can I say? <laughs> yeah, lots of the conditions might. Like, the university looking for yeah like teacher, a personal statement yeah. and yeah. measure yeah, like the background of the background information cv transcript and everything yeah yeah so not all so maybe they also if some people uh, if some students they prefer to uh, study some very professional skills maybe they can uh, focus on the major ranking as well, not uh, not university ranking. Exactly. Depends on what major they are coming, yes. but the university ranking also Turkish family is really considered like top top hundred, top two hundred yeah. is really important for the Turkish students as well. Uh, why? What's the reason of that? Because uh, the Turkish family thinks like if their student, uh, if their child going to good universities, mm -hmm. they could have a good job. Oh, so you mean the country will uh, ask the student, the graduated, uh, <laughs> where they come from, which university they come from? Like. Exactly. Oh. What about the Chinese people? Why? Why they consider like <laughs> we understand? <laughs> <laughs> As a big company, they will uh, prefer to hire the, uh, the student who is from the maybe G5 university. Yeah, that's very important for them. For entrance? Yeah. yeah. Thanks for your explaining for the Chinese student. We will consider, we will continue to drink our <laughs> teas and latte. I, I will go for the tea, but she, she is going for the coffee. But we will co uh, continue our chat. But I would like to thank you to explain us to Chinese students. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. You guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, you Çinliyseniz hiç fark etmez, Türkseniz de fark etmez. Yurt dışında ışınlanmak için yapmanız gereken tek bir şey var. Aşağıda koymuş olduğumuz butona tıklamak. Let's make it together, Michelle. Yeah. One, two.